Hey, this is Gus Monsanto from Adagio, and you are at Zanzana. Fire forever, domination. Get out. Gus Monsanto, so first time in Tunisia, I think. First impression. Oh man, Tunisia is just, reminds me a lot of my own country, which is Brazil. And you know, I could, I could imagine that it was cool, but I could never imagine Tunisia being as cool as it, as it really is, you know. All the people we met, the reaction we got from people, you know, it's been wild. It's been really wild. It's really, uh, what really surprised me the most was uh, how much Tunisian people are into heavy metal. It was just like, wow, it was really cool, really great. You didn't, didn't expect that? I expected it to be really yes. cool, but man, it, it, was, it, it was just like beyond beyond any expectations I could have had, really. How it was uh, being on stage in front of all this crowd? It was really amazing, you know. Uh, it was a really warm reception and I don't know, man, it's just... Wow, it, it's just like the crowd... Man, you know, it's, honestly, it's really hard to describe the feeling, you know. It's like great emotion and, you know, uh, you could feel the passion in people for for music it was really wow i was really blown away really i am blown away and I, i'm sure i'm going to remember my first time in tunisia for years to come oh thank you very much you, you did blow the blow them up oh man that's really that's really sweet yeah you did <laughs> uh did you ever felt this before on stage well uh, man it's really the feeling I just got off stage, so it's really um for me it's really hard to I'm still on the vibe of the people, you know, it's so much energy. It's well it's really hard to, to, to come down, you know. So it's like yeah, I, I really honestly cannot remember feeling the same way I do I, I did today because you know it was my first time in Africa, not only in Tunisia, you know, in Africa and Man, it was just like a wild, wild, wild experience. How is it in Brazil? Uh, the, the metal scene, we know Sepultura, we know Soulfly, things like this. Yeah, but yeah, yeah. The metal scene in Brazil is really huge, really amazing. The public is, I think, is, is very much like Tunisia in, in terms of really high energy. People really love heavy metal. It kicks ass. Yeah, it kicks major ass. And we have some amazing, amazing, you, you mentioned Sepultura and Soulfly. We had Overdose in the past, which is a band I played with. Sepultura's first guitar player, yeah. Gyro, who was in, in, you know, on the first two Sepultura albums. Um, after that, you know, we also have Shaman and Angra and all that. Plus, we have some great new bands like Atlantida and Karma yeah. and Tribuzi, who, who is a guy who did an album with Bruce Dickinson and Kiku from Angra and Michael Kisk, from, who used to be in Halloween. So we've got a, a lot of great people in there. Yeah. How, how do you uh, work with Adagio? Because I think that you live in Brazil. Yeah, you're right. I, I spend, <laughs> I spend a, a great amount of time in France working with the guys, but yeah, it's... It's, it's logistically it's very difficult, but you know, when you really want to do things, you make it work. Uh, we, we felt when listening to the last album of um, Adagio that you gave uh, something, a new, a new feeling, a new way of uh, a wrath. You brought your own, uh, your own uh, way to, to, the group, to the band. I don't know, man. It's just like David Reedman is an amazing singer. Wow. You know, it's really hard to, you know, really big 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 shoes to fill but uh the thing is my style we we, we come i come from the the same school as david like hard rock and uh fm stuff but i'm also very much into heavier stuff like pantera and you know death and i'm really wide in terms of influences so uh i don't know man i think uh, probably my voice is a little more aggressive i don't know so i think that based on that the the direction the band was was you know it's not we we wanted to write stuff that was much more stage oriented than uh, the previous stuff so it was really cool playing these tunes live it was the first time we played the song so it was really cool <laughs> and it works 
<laughs> Thank you so much. I'm glad you guys enjoyed it. Yeah. yeah we, we did enjoy it and we hope uh, only one thing that uh, we will enjoy it again. Oh man, that'll be that'll be really oh, man, a, an honor and a huge pleasure, you know, being able to to come back to Tunisia man as many times as we can because it was really beyond my wildest dreams. Tell me you live at, at Rio. Yeah, that's where I'm from. Really did you went to Rolling Sun's concert? Oh no, <laughs> it was it was crazy, man. My girlfriend is a huge Rolling Stones fan, but you know, I, I the 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 concert they had before in the in the in the in the beach was Lenny Kravitz, which I went to, but it was really amazing. But it was impossible to be there for more than five songs. It was a riot. You, you had you had around uh, one million. Yeah, one, yeah. One, one million. It was, it was something you, you could not believe. It's an entire huge beach filled with people. It was really yeah, mad. Some pictures. Uh, <laughs> very amazing. Yeah, very amazing. I watched it on. I watched it on TV, and I was like, wow. <laughs> I was playing with some friends uh, in a party in Brazil. It was like uh, we had the Stones on the on the big screen, and after that, we we, we played some. Van Halen and Deep Purple and even Stones, you know, just it was like a body, so it was really cool. Yeah. And, and uh, do you like it now with the rubber plant? <sighs> Man, what what can you say? It's like rock royalty, you know. Uh, are you a big master. fan of Led Zeppelin? Oh yeah. <laughs> how could so you not be, man? <laughs> so how 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 could you not be, man? It's just master, you know. It's like I don't know. You you, you can. I hope that one day I can look back at my own music, you know, music I've done like more than 30 years and have really still relevant music and continue making amazing music like Robert Robert is producing, you know, he's playing some great new songs. So, so thank you very much, Gus. Man, it's really, really my pleasure and, you know, hope that, that you know, the people in Tunisia had a great time and that we can come back and you're welcome again uh, whenever again you want. Again and again and yeah, again. I think they, they, they did have a very big good time. Okay, man. Thank you so much. Thank, Thank you very much. Zanzana! L'émission Metal!